right, so uh, we made a video before Worlds was back here in AR, and uh, it was with a different guy's rifle. This is my SPR that we built uh, on the video. You guys have probably seen. And uh, we got a lot of grief about the world's most accurate rifle video. It was super old, to keep in mind. This was like five, six years ago at least. It wasn't my rifle. He was shooting like 55 grain bullets. Super accurate AR, but not this thing. So what we're going to do is show you uh, just, I mean, it's kind of windy. It's getting dark, but uh, it's the end of the day. But uh, we're going to go and try 1,000 yards. Uh, I've got a little cowboy target out there. It's probably 18, 20 inches tall, 18 inches wide. Uh, we're shooting the uh, 77 grain burgers using TAC, um, and this is an 18 inch SPR rifle and gas system. We'll talk about the rest of it. Um, I don't have 20 ammo built into the to this mount. I do on this other optic, SWFA 3 to 15, but I've got the Cytron 10 to 50 on there. Just kind of test it out. Uh, so we're gonna hold over to 1,000 yards, and then we'll just come back. And go. Uh, I think the furthest we have is 800, you know, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. So we'll, uh, we'll have a little fun here. All right, I'm going to zoom in on this thing and then zoom out for me. So that little orange guy up on the right is our cowboy. Our wind is still doing the same thing. All right, so we're holding 38 and a half minutes. Elevation. Ooh. Shoulder height and left. Oh, just barely high. Bingo. That was an impact. So you get the idea. We can shoot a thousand yards of this baby. Uh, let's go ahead and back it out now. So go ahead and zoom out a little bit, and we'll go to I think the furthest target out there is seven hundred yards, right? Yes, seven. Seven hundred. It's a circle. So seven hundred yards. It's telling us we need no. to dial nineteen point eight. I think it is six. Oh, it's six. I think okay. so. Six hundred yards would be fifteen point one. So that's. 15, 15. All right. Let's see if we're uh, we got it right here. All right, ready? Bingo. Second impact. A little just for fun. Another impact. So we know we can shoot 600 yards. Let's do 500. It's getting less and less exciting. 11 minutes. Dial down to 11 minutes. Go to the square ones, 500. Impact. Impact. Out. Throw a few more in here real quick. Again, these are just range brass. We've had a lot of them with 77 grain burgers. We put them back link. The powder is tack. And the barrel is a white oak armament. Love their barrels. They are incredible. So now we're at 400? Yes. Yeah, 400, 7.3. 7 and a quarter minutes. And that one is. Circle, right? Yes. No problem. 300 yards, 4.2. This is too easy. Bing, bing, done. 
Zoom her out. Wow. In or out. All right, there's out. So, uh, I've mentioned a couple times online, you know, we plan on doing another video where we do the world's most accurate AR again. We'll feature this gun. We'll shoot some 100 yard groups with it. Um, and then uh, we want to do an event. We're actually going to do a world's most accurate AR event and invite people out to come out and show us if they've got the most accurate AR out there. Um, I'm not saying this is the most, absolutely most accurate AR I've ever built, but for an 18 inch SPR 223 Wildy, pretty awesome. So let me walk you through what it has. So I'm running a, a Luth AR stock. Absolutely love those guys. They're incredible. Um, they've even improved this. They've got one that's adjustable now or that's a, a carbine or carbine version. And then uh, they also have one more adjustment now. Uh, we have Ergo Grip, uh, Mega Billet Upper Lower. The bolt is a Fell Zero. I've got a JP Silent Buffer in here. Love those things. Um, Geisley SSAE Trigger. Got the Novetsky NSR Handguard Strike Industries. Love those guys too. Uh, they, I've got a couple of their small rails on here. Uh, love my Cytrons. Uh, this is a Cytron 10 to 50 by 60. This is their S5 series. Uh, it's got the, the turrets that you can lock, and it's got the fine focus and the, the fast focus. I've uh, got a Vortex anti cant on there. Got Burris tactical rings, high ones, because of this big bell. I uh, love these Vortex Defender flip caps, they're incredible. Uh, Templar Tactical 30 cal can. Uh, it's uh, uh, yeah, 30, uh, Templar Tactical. Then you've got the 18 inch wide oak armament barrel, that's really what makes this all happen. And then a Syrac Ordnance uh, adjustable gas block. And uh, Sucker's a shooter. So, also, I run the uh, SWFA 3 to 15 with an ADM mount on it. The beauty of this one is I don't have to hold over to 1,000 yards. It's got 20 minutes of angle, actually 30, and this one, 30 minutes of angle built into this mount. So, uh, even of this little 3 to 15, awesome scope for the money, best scope for the money I think you can get. Uh, I can dial that and hit a grand with this thing, the 223, which was today 38 and a half minutes. So, uh, hope you enjoyed the video. Keep watching Thanks. All right, John's gonna give it a shot. He's gonna try the thousand, and then we're gonna bring him back through all the other distances too. So, and uh, this is—I think this is the first time you've ever shot a thousand yards. Am I right? I've never even thought of trying a thousand yards, <laughs> let alone with a two-two-three AR, right? Yeah. All right. Let me get on the spotting scope. All right, go ahead. Bing! Did I hit that? First shot. Are you kidding me? You can tell because you can see the splatter, the dust below it. That is freaking awesome. Do it again. You holding it where you where you're supposed to? Yeah. Might just be getting well. Might the wind's kind of wind's actually kind of died, but oh, see it? That's just right. Just, just right. right of his hip. So just give it a little more wind and come up just a hair. Oh. You pulling it? I don't know. Nice easy squeeze. That's a two stage trigger. So you pull it back, and it's not going to go off till it hits that break, and then you break it. Nice, easy squeeze. We'll come back. Let's see. Hit the wall. Bing. Bing. Oh, well. See, you pull the trigger the right way, you got it done. Wow. I guess I jumped the ding. Sorry. No, you're fine. John, you can take your earplugs out. You can hear the ding. I don't. Oh, you don't have them in? Uh -huh. Okay. Go ahead. Well, I can hit a thousand yards. That's freaking cool. Yeah. With an AR. Oh. See it? Yep. Remember that trigger. Nice, easy squeeze through the. Just go through the first break and the second. This little, you're low on a couple of these, so come up just a hair. Give it a little more wind. Oh, right through, right underneath this junk. Yeah. Bing! Uh, yep. Andre. 
trail. All right, now come back through the other guys. So the first one was 600, I think it's 15 minutes. It's 15 minutes. Do it. Hit it again, 600 yards. Bing. Okay, 500 yards. I think it was, I'm trying to remember. 500 was 11 minutes. See that? Low and left. Impact. Okay, 400 yards is 7.3. So seven and a quarter. Hit it again. Bing! Too easy, right? <coughs> that is crazy. <laughs> A little bit of fun. That is nuts. <laughs> so, how, how far had you shot before today? Maybe 200 yards, but I don't even know if it would be that because I've never had a rangefinder. <laughs> So just a little backstory. So I threw it out on our Facebook group and said, "Hey, anybody interested in coming down and being my cameraman for the day and getting the uh, LRSU hoodie for the, for their efforts?" And uh, John did an awesome job filming today at the match, and then said, "Hey, let's go out and let you shoot." So we let him shoot a couple stages, and then uh, ran out of ammo. So I had my AR and thought, "Let's go and let him shoot the AR. See what he thinks." So, uh, well, what do you think? That is awesome. That's. I wouldn't have believed it. <laughs> Speechless. Hooked? Yes, definitely. I'm in the market for a new scope. <laughs> Very good. Well, like I said, that SWFA we had out there earlier, that's really the one I run on that one. I just I got the Cytron from Cytron and wanted to test it out. I'm probably going to put it on my 22 for competition, but... Um, threw it on there, and the only downside is, is I don't have the, the minutes of angle built into the, the mount. So I can't get to a thousand with it. It caps out about 27 minutes, 28 minutes, and it needs 38 minutes to get there. And with that ADM mount on the other one with the SWFA, you know, you can get there without anything. I mean, this little optic is pretty awesome. I mean, it's what, $6.99, I think, on SWFA.com, and it's 3 to 15 power. It's all in mills. It's got a beautiful diamond reticle. Really love it. Uh, ADM mounts are great. Um, I bet you... It, if I could remember where exactly I placed it, I bet we could pop it on there right now. The thing it holds zero. I mean, these things are really pretty incredible. And this particular one has 30 minutes of angle built into the mount, so literally I can dial a grand with this thing and pop it. In fact, we hit a jug three shots with this rifle. So lots of fun. Well, thanks, John. Thank you. Did you have a good time? I had a blast. That's awesome. That's real. Love bringing you guys out here for the first time. Lots of fun. Dead air armament. Oh, yeah. Hi, I'm Kelly McMillan. Red Shot Show 2016. We're gonna give it a shot right now. 